And now we take a look at some business news from Southside Virginia. For the second time since the beginning of the year, the Southern Virginia mega site at Berry Hill in Pennsylvania County almost landed a high profile development. According to Cardinal News, Albemarle Corporation, which is a chemical manufacturing company, selected a site in Chester County, South Carolina for a new lithium hydroxide processing facility, pledging to invest at least $1.3 billion in creating 300 jobs. Lee Vogler, a city councilman in Danville, said the Berry Hill site was a finalist for the project and that Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin was personally involved in conversations with Albemarle. Delegate Danny Marshall said that officials at the Virginia Economic Development Partnership told him that Albemarle chose the South Carolina site because it was closer to the company's main facility in Charlotte, North Carolina. The Chester County site is 800 acres, and Albemarle is expected to produce about 50,000 metric tons of battery-grade lithium hydroxide there annually. A report, a report in Reuters said that the average pay for plant employees will be $93,000. Vogler says that Albemarle Company officials were very fond of the site, but the location was a little too much for them to overcome. Earlier this year, Governor Youngkin removed the Berry Hill site from consideration for a Ford electric battery plant over concerns that a Chinese company would have owned the technology. Last May, the site lost out on a $5.5 billion Hyundai electric vehicle battery plant, which went to Savannah, Georgia, and in 2018, a possible Mazda Toyota manufacturing plant went to Huntsville, Alabama. As of 2020, Albemarle Corporation was the world's largest provider of lithium for electric vehicle batteries. Now, if you'd like to read more about the project, and there's a lot more information there, you can visit the website cardinalnews.org.